four masses attached to a shaft and their respective radii of rotation are given as m1, m2, m3, m4 and their respective radii are given and the angles between successive masses are 45 degree, 75 degree and 135 degree find the position and magnitude of balance mass required if the, its radius of rotation is 0.2 meter the mass is revolving in same plane so I'm solving this problem by analytical method given first write down the given and what is given four masses are given 180 kg m2 is 300 kg m3 is 230 kg m4 is 260 kg the respective radii r1 is 0 0.2 meter r2 is 0 0.15 meter r3 is given 0 0.25 meter r4 is given 0 0.3 meter now angle so angle of first mass is 0 degree theta 2 successive angle between successive masses is, that is angle between m1 and m2 is 45 degree so theta 2 i have to draw here one diagram so this is mass m1 theta of this mass is 0 degree now the angle between mass m1 and m2 is 45 degree on 45 degree mass m2 is there this is the 45 degree so theta 2 is equal to 45 degree now angle between m2 and m3 is 75 degree so 45 plus 75 is 120 degree from x axis this is the mass m3 which is 120 degree from positive x axis so theta 3 is 120 degree the angle between m3 and m4 is 135 degree so 120 plus 135 you get theta 4 is equal to 255 m4 is equal to this angle is 255 degree theta 4 is 255 degree and the radius of rotation of balancing mass is given so rb is equal to 0 0.2 meter now you have to find mb and their position theta b so let us to find mb and theta b m b and theta b here formula is required we require formula so formula of resultant centrifugal force is sigma h square plus sigma v square and Fc is equal to you know Fb that is equal to Mb into Rb and theta b position of this balancing mass Mb is equal to 180 plus theta dash and theta dash is equal to tan inverse summation V divided by summation H we have to find summation V and summation H for that draw table so this is a simple method of solution m r this is m r then theta then m r sin theta then m r cos theta so this table you have to draw so m write down mass is here 180 300 230 260 or 0 0.2 0.15 0.25 and 0.3 mr that is m into r 180 into 0 0.2 0 0.25 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 0 0.3 
is 36 300 into 0 0.15 is 45 230 into 0 0.25 is 57.5 then 216 to 0 0.3 is 78 then theta 0 degree 45 degree 120 degree and 255 degree now MR sin theta is MR into sin 0, 0, 45 into sin 45, 31.8198, 57.5 sin 120, 49.7964, 255, 78 into sin 255 is minus 75.3422. Then MR cos theta, 36 cos 0, 36, then 45 cos 45 is 31.8198, then 57.5 cos 120 is minus 28.75, then 78 cos 255 is minus 20.1878. This table, we must draw this table so that remaining procedure is very simple. So this table you have to draw first. So this is the summation V and this is summation H. Summation of Vertical centrifugal forces, summation of horizontal centrifugal forces. So now summation V is equal to add these values, add these values, all values of this column. You get summation V is equal to 6.274 kg meter. Now add the values of this column. You get summation H is equal to 18.882 kg per kg meter. Now find out resultant centrifugal force Fc is equal to summation H square plus summation V square that is equal to root 18.882 square plus 6.274 square you get the value of balancing centrifugal force Fc is equal to 19.897 kg meter now we know and the position of this centrifugal force theta dash is equal to tan inverse summation V divided by summation H so tan inverse Summation V is 6.274 divided by summation H 18.882. So theta dash becomes the position of this balancing, position of this centrifugal force. Theta dash becomes 18.3803 degree. Now find out the balancing mass. We know Fc is equal to Fb is equal to mb into rb therefore mb rb is equal to fc is equal to how much 19.897 kg meter now mb is equal to 19.897 divided by rb and rb is given 0 0.2 rb value of rb is given so therefore mb is equal to mb becomes 99.897 485 kg this is the value of balancing mass magnitude of balancing mass now position of this balancing mass theta b is equal to you know 180 plus theta dash 180 plus theta dash this formula we to use 180 plus theta dash is 18.380803 so theta b becomes 198.3803 degree from 
198.3803 degree from this positive x axis this is this will be something here this is mb 0.2 meter and this theta b is 198.3803